word is out, a leopard has been seen. Look at this. Yeah. Another early start, but Yala National Park today, the second largest but most popular safari park or national park in Sri Lanka. It's got one of the densest populations of leopards anywhere in the world, so that's one of the main reasons you come here. I've heard that it can be absolutely manic on the weekends, so it's a Monday, it's before 7 a.m. Just buying our tickets. I have a Jeep to myself which I've never had before. Quite interested to see whether it's just crazy busy or on the weekdays it's actually fine. You see elephants, peacocks, deer, but just want to see a leopard. I haven't seen a leopard in years. I don't think it's fair to uh, compare it to African safari, but let's see. Should be a nice day. Wild pigs. See wild pigs already. But uh, you know what safari means. After following that peacock ground for days in South Africa, it's been four minutes and I've seen a peacock doing its thing. Apparently there's loads of peacocks here, so no need to get too excited about it. I am. Apparently we've just missed a leopard. It sits on this rock. But now that the sun's coming up, it's gone down. It's rare that I'm late in the morning. So it's a thousand square kilometers. Yellow yeah, National Park, but it's split into five blocks. I've come to block one, which happens to be the most popular. I think it's because it's the easiest to get to. And the entrance was manic, there was probably 10 Jeeps, but now it's starting to spread out a bit. Just on the hunt for leopards. Leopards and maybe elephants. See lots of peacocks, but it's all about the leopards. I just hope we're not too late and we just missed that one. Hopefully we can find another but they're elusive little buggers. Maybe been on safari four times and seen one leopard.
very peaceful here. It's very peaceful. Are there, all, are there always elephants here? No. Oh, he's on, a, he's on a call. The beauty of having your own Jeep is that you can stop and go whenever, wherever you want, rather than people wanting to take pictures of things that you don't want to, or uh, maybe wanting to stay longer, or, or, you know, you have that flexibility, is what I'm trying to say. You pay for it, obviously, but it's quite nice. Still haven't seen any leopards. Do you think we'll see leopards now? Too late. You've just one leopard this morning. So we we won't see any more leopards anymore. Why not? Have, uh, yeah, there are 4,000 acres this area. Block one? Block one, yes, safari area. And there's 30 leopards? Uh, 35 leopards. Uh, in yes. block one? Block one, yes. But you don't see them at this time? We're too late? Yeah, too late, yes. Nice, I like this place. Yeah, I like it. It's very, very nice. It's very peaceful. Relaxing. Just to see and watch an elephant do its thing. Which is just eat all day. Very peaceful. Relaxing. So apparently somebody's seen a leopard and now everybody's literally racing there. There's jeeps overtaking us. We're going pretty quickly. I think it might be chaotic. But hopefully we see one. Jeez. Word is out, a leopard has been seen. Look at this. Everybody's just trying to get there as quickly as possible. Very interested to see how many people there are going to be there. It's gone. It's like wacky races. Oh. These are all the Jeeps that got here quick enough, but apparently it's already gone. We'll wait. I guess the word got out. Everybody's turning up. There's no leopard. It's just lots of congestion. It's something that um, the actual Yala website mentioned. And the block one is very congested. So that's an issue. It really is an issue. I mean, this is... Even if there was a leopard, I wouldn't be able to see it. We've parked up because Apparently there's a mother leopard and three babies. And this is the only watering hole around. Problem is, is they drink three times a day and they were just here. So the likelihood of them coming back is low. But we've already seen elephants and there's not many other animals to see. Where, what's the, um, the park? Udawalawa Ud Udawalawa elephant, yes. Udawalawa. Udawalawa, yes. Udawalawa is better for elephants. Apparently there's lots of elephants, but they do have leopards, right? But not many. No, no, no leopards. No leopards? No. Okay. They have lots of elephants, but no leopards. Yala has lots of leopards, but not that many elephants. So you sort of have to make your choice. Those are the two um, big attractions. I think. It doesn't look like I'm going to be lucky. It's a problem with trying to, uh, well, wild animals don't uh, fit their day around your itinerary. So that's the risk you take. Bye bye. Ah. 
Hi. Thanks, man. Hi. Thanks a lot, man. Thank Cheers. So he said that uh, he sees leopards 20 to 30% of the time and it's better in the evening. So perhaps you would want to set a hotel um, around here. It's a hard one because, you know, as I said, wildlife don't plan their day around your itinerary and it's the risk you take. So I don't have a problem with not seeing the animals I want to see. It's an expensive day, it cost me 10,000 to get a taxi from Medigama to here and back and then another 10,000 or so for entry and the Jeep. So you're looking at what, $100 for the day? Well, it's more like a half day. The one problem that I do have is that even if there were leopards, as soon as word's out, all of the Jeeps just flock to that area. The rumors of Yala being crowded are true. I reckon we were driving for four hours there's maybe five minutes total where I couldn't see another Jeep and you're usually just in a queue of Jeeps, which is not ideal. If you haven't done safari before, maybe go to Uduwalawa or one of the less popular parks. See more elephants, you won't see leopards. If you have done safari and you're just here for leopards, then Yala's probably your best bet, but there's probably better options for the overall experience. That's it for me. Time to head back. Bye bye.